My name is Justin Nace and I play drums for Paris. I got my very first drum kit when I was maybe like five or six and never really picked it up and actually tried to, you know, sit there and learn it until maybe I was about like 12 or 13 when I started making it, you know, an actual serious commitment to it. And uh, yeah, I never took lessons. I'm left-handed, so kind of just taught myself. But I remember first drum kit had little tiny tin cymbals, but my very first cymbal that I actually got was a ride cymbal from Zildjian. And uh, actually, I think it's still at my parents' house. They still have it down in their basement, but that was the first time I was introduced into Zildjian. And that was like my first legitimate uh, piece of equipment that I had ever gotten outside of the drum kit. And uh, yeah, I've been playing Zildjian pretty much ever since. Yeah, I started playing with Paris about almost about a year and a half, two years ago, um, through mutual friends from a band a few years back called Versa Emerge, and uh, their, uh, their guitar player Blake actually produced their album, and through meeting him and hanging out with him a lot, he actually introduced me these guys to Paris, and my drum company, SJC, they actually had mutual friends with those guys, so it just was kind of a small world, and I uh, started playing with them, and been playing with them ever since. When I was younger, I think one of the first things I remember going when I was maybe like eight years, my parents took me to go um, get lessons and the guy was like, yeah, you know, I'm not really going to teach anybody unless they switch to right handed. But being eight years old, you're kind of like, no way, I'm not going to do that. You know, so I kind of just used to sit at home. I used to play to like Nirvana and like classic 80s, like Cinderella and like Motley Crue. And I just used to watch music videos of Motley Crue and Tommy Lee flipping sticks and stuff. And, you know, people like Led Zeppelin with like John Bonham, just so many different artists. That's kind of, I just used to pick and pull from everybody I could, you know, and just try to see what their style was. And even to this day, when you go see a, you know, a show, constantly watching the drummers and just seeing what their style is like, because there's always infinite possibilities to be able to learn new things. Right now, I pretty much play all A custom cymbals. I've been playing those ones for a while now. Such a good sound, um, very bright for what we play, and it definitely cuts through the mix very well. Um, and durable too, I'm a pretty heavy hitter, um, so they're able to kind of, seems like they wave with it and kind of give it a little bit more play when I'm hitting it harder. My hi-hats are 14 inch A custom um, hats, and then we move to my 20 inch A custom crash. Um, I have a 22 inch A custom ride and a 20 inch ride that I use for a crash as well um, on the left hand side. And then I have one of the Oriental Chinas, it's an 18 inch. Um, seldomly use that one there in the mix, you know. And as well as a small, I have the six inch Zilbel that I've had for a while. Just gives a nice little accent outside of the ride symbol's bell.